Hello, I have a little keyboard here. Um, for fun, I play uh, guitar and keyboards. And um, so this is one of my keyboards. It's actually a MIDI controller. Uh, the reason why I'm showing you this is because I want to show you something uh, interesting. Now, I don't know. It's just a funny coincidence. I don't think it is. Okay, there's seven colors of the rainbow. And um, God promised to Noah through the sign of the covenant that he made with Noah. And the covenant was that he would not... Uh, cause the earth to be flooded again by water and that that rainbow was a was a sign of this promise so every time you see the rainbow that means God's still honoring that covenant that uh, there would not be a flood again okay and uh, there's seven colors to the rainbow and as you know the the number seven is very significant in the Bible and also the number uh, 12 is very significant. The two most significant numbers, I think, in the Bible are 7 and possibly 12, maybe 3. I don't know. 3 is a big one, too. Okay, and another one is 8, because on the 8th day, they would be circumcised, their uh, children. Okay. Um, so, now, uh, I wanted to talk to you, sorry, it's a little bit late here, um, about music. There are 12 notes in a chromatic scale. Chromatic scale is basically on a keyboard the most granular uh, level of scale. Okay, and a scale would be like, okay, I hit that, hit that, hit that, hit that, that, and da 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 da, like that. I don't know if you've seen that. And uh, so there's 12 notes. There's actually 11 notes in that scale, okay, but we call it a 12 tone scale and I don't know why but we do because that the, the lowest note on the scale matches the highest note on the scale if the lowest note on the chromatic scale 12 note chromatic scale is a C the highest note is a C so I don't know why they do that but okay now the major scale so that's the number 12 is significant there and another thing interesting about that notice how I said there's 12 of them but there's actually 11 and there was like 12 apostles, but actually one of them was uh, a son of perdition, Judas, right? But there's actually 12 because then there's Paul. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but anyway, so uh, what I said about Paul being 12, just, just scratch that. Uh, that's another whole study. <laughs> so anyway, then there's seven notes in a major scale. And that's, da, da, and I don't have a piano right here, so... But it's these white keys going from the C to the C is a C major scale. And that's eight notes there from C to C and seven notes. So it's called a seven-note scale because there's seven different notes in that scale. Minor scale, same thing, but it starts, you know, it's got a different sequence. Like A minor is the relative minor to C. But that's just music lesson. This is not a music, music lesson. So it's just interesting how... The rainbow has got all the colors, and music seems to lay out in a similar pattern. Uh, excuse me, you know, at least the Western musical scales fit into that pattern, you know, of this 12 and, and 7 note pattern. And so it's really cool, and, um, you know, there's music in the Bible, too, you know, so music is... Uh, is uh, a creation of God. It's something that God created us for us to enjoy and sing songs to each other. And uh, so that's really cool. And I've been thinking a little bit about more seriously about music. Um, you know, that if I've been given a gift from God to compose music or play an instrument or something like that, that maybe I should do it for His glory instead of just playing around. Um, I kind of avoided that for a while, but I'm starting to take it a little bit more seriously. And the music that's in my head is it seems to have gone up to another level that seems to be a level where it's like I can't just ignore it. It's like I'd like to get it on paper and like to um, compose the music that's in my head. It's a little bit more um, 
a little bit more on a higher level, it's like I'm starting to be able to imagine music um, that's a little bit better. So anyway, and there's they're not difficult melodies to play so much. So anyway. But anyway, that's a totally different topic. I don't know why I'm talking about music other than that I was just going to show you that um, that little thing. In case you didn't know about that, now you do. You can say, hey, I didn't know that. 